Okay, on to the fashion scene now. In the fashion world, designers showcase various cuts and styles with leather material at the Lagos Leather Fair recently. More details in this feature. Leather and its derivatives within the fashion world take center stage in Lagos, southwest Nigeria, as fashion heads converge at the Lagos Leather Fair. The runway comes alive with different leather designs for garments and fashion accessories including handbags and shoes. Because I felt that there was a need to create um, a platform for leather designers to um, showcase their talent, to showcase their products. There was no existing platform like this and there were so many um, creative people in this space and we felt that there was a need to um, bring them together and begin to discuss the challenges, change the narrative around Made in Nigeria and see how we could make this ecosystem work. There's so many challenges surrounding, of course, power, infrastructure, um, skills gaps, quality gaps, technology gaps, but I think that we just need to start somewhere by recognizing the fact that there's talent in that space and that there's a need to move the industry forward. While many sometimes view leather as luxurious and exquisite within the fashion world, practitioners believe its durability in the long run makes it worth the price. I mean, leather is animal skin, so it's malleable, it's supple, it's long-wearing, and more than anything, it's comfortable because it stretches, you know. And the leather can be dyed into different colors, so, I mean... And then it lasts, it lasts very well. It lasts longer than synthetics. I've been making shoes for 20 years. I just had a customer come into my shop now and tell me that she has a pair of shoes she bought from us 18 years ago and that she still wears them. She said the only thing she had to change was the sole. Leather is a coveted fashion material, which is abundant in its semi-processed form in northern Nigeria. Unfortunately, Current realities mean foreign fashion designers have easier access to Nigerian leather than local designers. So the limitations we have as availability of raw materials locally and consistency in the supply because um, what happens is they, they, they'd rather, the tanneries in Kano would rather sort of mass produce, semi-process and export in containers and containers obviously to earn FX rather than sort of sell to us small players. I mean there are a few tanneries that do sell in the some sort of smaller quantities to us which we're grateful for, but I wish there would be like a bigger focus on the leather industry so that we can generate and produce our own leather in Nigeria, like up to a finished standard rather than semi-processed. So obviously buying the finished leathers, we have to import. So FX rates are not very favorable. Um, it would be great if we could do it in-house and locally, then obviously you eliminate all the additional charges of transportation and logistics and all of that stuff, so yeah. The Leather Fair hopes to open up the leather-driven value chain within the fashion industry to create more opportunities. Yeah.